to secure that expansion so much. And I am going for gas first, even though I'm low on minerals, because I'm pro like that. I know what I'm doing, I swears, baby. Um, <laughs> tons of missile turrets coming up um, in case he goes for banshees, but of course he hasn't yet, so I have no idea why I'm doing that. Maybe because of the medevac drops, I was scared of those. Uh, I wish I could salvage these missile turrets, to be honest with you, because these are the ones that you really don't need um, after a while. I mean, look, these guys are guarding, what, 135, 160, 210, so... About three, about 500 minerals there, and of course these cost what? I don't even know anymore. Oh, and he's going for his third expansion. But that's about as many minerals in missile turrets as I'm guarding. I don't need these here. Uh, why can't I salvage these? Who cares about the bunker? The bunkers they can stay. <laughs> they can stay there forever. But, oh, and he's securing an expansion as well. These tanks here are going to be the death of me. I can tell you that right now. It's almost whoever has more tanks will win. And, of course, he's got them. He does have Siege researched. And he was continuing to pump out the army, and he's getting level 2 upgrades. He is now 1-1. One, one. I am still 1-0. I do have concussive shells, as does he. No combat shields on either one. Uh, it's really going to be a, a matter of who attacks, and it looks like he's going to be attacking, but no, I move in, and I am so unexpectedly in a battle here. I did not expect that. Siege takes sieging up. He did get his in first. There goes the stim for me. He had already been stimmed, and now, of course, I have no sight. Oh... And down goes everybody, but he's got no anti-air left, so I'm taking out the everything that I can possibly take out. Planetary Fortress going up. What? No real command for me. I did see this coming because I was so paranoid about him pushing all the time that I decided, you know what? I need to get a Planetary Fortress instead of Orbital Command. Marines finally coming in. Scaring me off. He's getting a Thor to counter with these Vikings. I am not getting anything. It looks like, though, he does have quite a few Marines outside his base. Uh, this is not something I expected. I didn't go for the counter around back. But look at that. Look how many mer minerals he left back here. Oh, my gosh. That's, what's that, like 3,000? Good lord, what are you doing? Just completely abandoning his first base. What is his income? Even though he's got three bases as opposed to my two, and he's got more harvesters, I'm I'm roughly even with him. I'm gonna call that even. Even I have more gas, definitely. I have more gas. He's working off three. I'm working off four gas. But in terms of minerals, it's going back and forth. Uh, thanks to those mules. So. Early expansion's not always the best way if you don't saturate them, and he's not saturating them. These Thors, though, uh, unupgraded, as well as the tanks. Uh, they do have siege upgrade, but that is it. And, of course, he did see this expansion here. Um, I had to send a SCV down, and, of course, I didn't see this Marine here. So he is able to spot that expansion, but he's not really seeming to do anything about it. So here I am going to be taking the lead. No, maybe. So he constantly sees SCV streaming that way, uh, but he's continuing to secure this expansion here. He does have the high ground, so of course when I go into attack with cloaked banshees, that should help, shouldn't they? Everybody's dying, but. Oh, they don't have enough energy to stay with it, do they? 11, 10, 9, oh! But he's getting massive amounts of kills. Just the two Banshees left. What am I doing? Take out the, the, take out the tanks. Oh, and there goes a the scan, and the Thor is able to take them out quite easily. Uh, the Thor. What am I doing? 
if I I had cloaked banshees, why am I going after a zombie? I need to go after his production, uh, his mineral lines here, here, and one SCV on 3,000 minerals there. Of course, the planetary fortress is saving me now. Um, he is unable to take that out, and he is wasting quite a bit of his army on it. Of course, I have wasted more of my army, 3,000 more now. Um, but the, those siege tanks... They might be in too much. One Marauder left. No, they are out of range of the Planetary Fortress, so it will finally go down thanks to these massive amounts of tanks. I do not have that many tanks, and it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to produce it uh, because I am stuck on one factory. Why don't I have more factories? And of course, these SCVs are going to go die because I don't like SCVs, apparently. Um, it looks like I tried to send them over to the other expansion that I had here, but it was far too late. Another skin going down for him. He wants to make sure there's no Banshees attacking, even though I don't think there's any Banshees here. Missile turrets are going to be going down. And look at the size of that. Oh my gosh, 90 supplies as opposed to 59 that I'm just able to get now. Um, I'm messing my army here. Hopefully the high ground will save me. Oh no, the siege tanks are just too much. Too many siege tanks. Look at that, he's got five. Four of which are sieged up, sieged up now. Uh, so it's really going to be game over here. Oh my goodness, even though I had the lead in minerals almost the entire game. Uh, he is a able to out-tech me and out-time me and out-play me with some good micro using the, the, the mech for Terrans, something that I have not been doing very well. Uh, I am getting better at it, but it's something that I allowed to happen this game. Um, so, good game to Mr. Hands. Uh, he is apparently very quick with his hands. How fast is he? He's faster than me, that's for sure. Um, so, really, more than one factory. This isn't helping anybody. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the game. Hope to see you next time. Bye.